What's up? What's up? It's your boy Dear Me two times, man. Look, I ain't know what else to do today, so I'm just gonna bring y'all my PCC collection. I don't have a lot, but I do have. Them. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go from the cheapest to the most highest price one that I have. Uh, I'm gonna start it out with the good old bad talk high point. It's a high point 995, chambered in nine millimeter. I got three magazines. I bought the, um, I don't know, the combo package. It came with the Ford Brill, you know, three magazine mag holders. It, I mean, the mud heavy, it's ugly, but it ain't let me down. You know what I'm saying? It ain't let me down, y'all. Every time I squeeze the trigger, it's firing. I ain't had a hang up on it. Oh uh, man, I believe this this carbine or carbine is different from the high point pistols. To me, they seem like they made in two totally different places. But so this joint right here function. Don't get me wrong, I do have a high point pistol at my pop's house, and I ain't never had a malfunction out of it, but I do not run cheap ammo through it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I've been had this one for going on probably about four, about four years now. And like I said, man, it's, it's been, well, five years. And it has been good to me, you know. And I, sh I actually shoot it a lot, man. Um, like I said, man, it's, 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 it's doing the do, man. Like I said, it is empty. Let me unlock the boat. It's empty. Um. You got the bolt hold open right there. You just press in on the actual charging handle and it locks the boat in. Throw your magazine in, pull it out. It's already charged. You're ready to go. Let's move it to the next one. My next one is the Fold PCC. Oh yeah. This is right here by Caltech. Oh yeah, I got this thing. Look, this right here is usually beside the bed. But, you know what I'm saying? This right here, man, I'm probably gonna throw an optic on here. They got an optic that can mount here and it rotates when you fold it. Uh, this is a uh, Chamberlain's 40 Smith & Wesson. It is empty. Nothing in the chamber, but the mag was loaded. Um, 3D barrel. It's one thing I do like about it. It got 3D barrel on it. And man, this thing right here, man, I done shot it out to 100 yards. And man, it's, it's pretty dang accurate, man. This charging handle, man, this, 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 this actual spring in here is pretty tight, you know. But like I say, it's, it's nice. It's nice, man. And it's up Glock mags. So. When I usually carry this, if I carry it as a truck gun because it can stow away real easy, I'll run my Glock uh, 22 with me so I can interchange magazines, you know. It's got a um, press button safety on here, bar safety. I guess that's what you would call it. Um, cannot be fired in the folding position, uh, man. I mean, it's nice, man. It's even got a ring if you want to carry it over the one-point sling. So, I mean, you can't, you can't, can't really argue with it, man. Can't really argue with it. Um, it's, you know, it's pretty light too, so it would be a good backpack rifle as well. Let's move it on. This one right here is my FM9 Mike Foxtrot 9. Oh yeah, I got a pretty good deal off of this. I did go and change the hardware. I went with the uh, Rise Armament. Let me make sure this is empty. Nope. But there's nothing in the chamber. I try not to keep nothing in the chamber when I'm storing these. Um, but like I said, I swapped out the safety on it. The pins, I actually swapped those out as well. It easily take down just like a regular AR, but it is chambered in nine millimeter. 
It, I mean, it's it's awesome, man. And it functions well. This thing functions well, man. Um, I put the flip up sights on here. I have a Vortec on here as well. This is a Vortec uh, red dot, man. This is the Crossfire red dot. And man, it, boy, it's holding zero. I can bump this thing around. And I said, it's another good a good truck gun if you want it to be. Um, I mean, it's awesome. It's awesome, man. It's got adjustable stock, but it is locked in place. Well, this is not a stock. This is an arm brace. Let me correct it right now. This is an arm brace. You should not put this up to your stock unless it's accidental, but it is for your cheek wrist. You can put it on your cheek. And it's for to be fired with one hand, you know, but other than that, man, this thing is nice. Hopefully, when I get a suppressor here soon, this is a threaded barrel too. So I should be able to put my uh, suppressor on this and work it as well. Uh, these are flip up sights. They get down, but they do coat with this with the red dot. It's got a heavy bolt in it too as well. Like I said, this is right armament, charging handle, safety and pins. It's nice, man. Let's move it on to the next one. This is the one I paid the most for. And this is a Scorpion Evo 3. Oh yeah. Everybody know that the Scorpion has a three to barrel, you know. I got these sights right here. This is a Vortec Crossfire as well, but it co-witnesses with the CZ sights. That's one reason I got it, cause I could, you know, use it lower down to mount it lower on the uh, actual platform. And this right here, it's a SBA arm brace. And man, I think I'm gonna do some upgrades to it. I may upgrade the safety. Pretty much not gonna touch this, uh, I don't think I'm gonna touch it. This uh, grip here. I may change out the trigger. It is, it's empty. It's empty. Uh, I may do the mag release upgrade on this one. Man, this thing, it shoot pretty well, man. It got the hand stop up here. You know, you don't want your hand to slide out there and blow them fingers off. Those guys, nice hand stop up here. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know, man. This thing is is nice, man. Like I said, it's Scorpion Evo S1. You know what I'm saying? It's three S1. It's 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 nice, man. Uh, it got the QDs on here. You no. Know, so you can run your QDs. Uh, man, this thing fires re real well, man. Uh, I actually have to go sight this one in and sight the uh, Foxtrot FM9 in. I actually have to go sight both of these in. Um, I got them board sighted, but you know, me being a hunter, I do like to have mine dialed all the way in. I don't want to just hit paper. I want to dang near have you know, two inch, I mean, one inch or one and a half inch uh, group, you know what I'm saying? At that 50 yard mark. And that's why I'm gonna sight these in at 50 yards. Um, 50 yards do me well, man. I know I can engage at 50, 25, you know, all of that with the 50 yard zero on these, man. Like I said, I do like, like this CZ. Cause you can compact it and throw it in a backpack as well, if need be. So, I mean, I appreciate y'all rocking with me. Your boy got PCC love, man. I got them all over me, all over me, man. Look, dear me, two time TV, man. I appreciate y'all watching me, man. I appreciate y'all watching me. I appreciate y'all tapping in, man. And if I can help y'all with anything, man, or if you need to ask me a question, 
All you gotta do is hit my um, inbox on Instagram. It's Dear Me Two Time TV. Hey, I appreciate y'all, man. Like, subscribe, and follow Dear Me Two Time TV, man. Dear Me Two. So <laughs>